That's all you need to see. What's it say? I'm afraid. Uh, my name on it. <laughs> got mail? You got it up? Yeah. Hey, you guys don't have to be so quiet, okay? If I stick it to two feet and I'm the first right. one up, right. you guys should not hit the pen. Don't hit the ground. Do you guys know where's Ann gone? Uh, what's has, that? Has Ann left? I now? don't know if she has. I saw her walk in the clubhouse, um, but I didn't see where she went. She no. should be the one in the No, no, no. Spotlighted at the Remax Military Long Drive Military Night. Wow. And uh, dined with the VIPs in the tent that night, so. We hope to raise a lot of money. You've sold out the tournament here, I understand. Sold, sold out the tournament, yeah. Now, what I'm going to do next year is actually, I'm going to book the tee today for next year so that I can actually get 144 players out here. We've only got 88 because uh, it was kind of short notice, but we sold it out in about four days. So, exciting. In Texas. And I think it's a wonderful thing that we're doing across the the country to help out the spouses and children of all the vets that were injured or killed in Iraq and Afghanistan. And I, as a veteran, I really appreciate the fact that all of the public supports the troops so much. Um, unlike when we were um, first in the military during Vietnam era. And, you know, we remember that. And we're so happy to see these kinds of things that people are doing for the vets now. Yeah. Those that are serving right now. Uh, you know, any you know, this tournament is you know it benefits the troops and their families that have served in the wars, and you know any time that I can come out and participate in any golf tournament that does that, being a veteran, I'm all for it. What about yourself? You served in the in the Navy certainly for a while. Yeah. Tell me about your experience. Uh, you know, I served from '93 to '98. Did a couple tours over you know in the Bosnia conflict and then spent a lot of time in the uh, Caribbean doing uh, counter drug operations. What are, you th what are your thoughts on the troops right now that are out there serving Iraq, Afghanistan, in the Middle East? Uh, you know it's it's a brutal job and uh, you know I support them a hundred percent and you know the, the sooner that they can come home with uh, mission accomplished the better.